Hello, hello, hello. This is Gresh from the I Am CEO podcast. We just recorded an awesome episode with Joy Price um, from Jumpstart HR. And I know we talked a little bit because of when we're recording this on uh, the COVID virus and how like entrepreneurs and business owners can repair different things they can do. Like your interview won't go live until later on in, in May, but I know because of the, um, I guess the, the, the pressing information that you have that I wanted to kind of make sure that we gave you an opportunity to talk a little bit more about that for entrepreneurs and business owners. Yeah. Well, first of all, my thoughts and prayers go out to every family that is impacted by the coronavirus outbreak, whether it's from a medical emergency or even just way down from the stress of it all. Uh, hopefully we are all safe and sound on the other side of it together and we're all doing our part, but specifically for small businesses and startups, that need to know about the coronavirus and how it may impact your business, I can speak to what it means for groups that have employees and to the freelancer. So I'll start with the larger population first of individuals that have members of their team. There's four key areas that you want to pay attention to. And those four key areas are going to be the, um, the, the workplace travel. Uh, it's going to be work stoppages or potential for work stoppages. It's going to be employee safety. And it's going to be sick time and paid time off. So just to address each of those really quickly with work travel, at this point, it's a, a mandatory requirement that um, you should be reevaluating non-essential travel. But an employee may come to you and say, hey, I really had this trip planned. I'd like to take it. Uh, my perspective is that you want to err on the side of caution and, and firmly caution against them taking any trips at this point. At this point, simply because you don't know what their re-entry will look like and the loss of productivity that may happen if they're asked to self-quarantine. Um, the next thing is with uh, work stoppages. There may be potential layoffs, there may be slower production needs, or if you are in a creative or a conference uh, or an industry that's impacted by the coronavirus in general, there just may not be any work. Uh, thankfully, both federal and state governments are working really, really hard to provide unemployment benefits. But as, as a owner of a business, I would make sure that you have a plan in place for what you will do in the event that you have to have temporary furloughs or layoffs and what that might look like. Um, the next thing is employer safety and employee safety. Hey, send people home. Uh, if they can work from home, then do that. Uh, figure out the logistics on the other side of it. But you want to make sure that you're keeping your employees safe. You're doing your attempt to flatten the curve and you're um, encouraging your employees to make wise decisions around handshakes, hugs, uh, washing hands, things of that nature. And then last but not least, I kind of touched on it, but paid leave and sick leave, just do the right thing. Remember that uh, your employees are going to be your employees even after this coronavirus hits. So you want to make sure that you have a policy that is fair, that you communicate early and often, and that you are doing your due diligence to make sure that you're following guidelines, not only uh, for where your company is headquartered, but also if you have employees that live and work remotely. Um, so every city state and federal uh city county and state has their own guidelines and then last for the freelancer hey my heart goes out to you uh, i know this could be a challenging time i would jump on sites like upwork fiverr um, reach out to your network see what you can do to get some projects started uh, go to sites like teachable and maybe create some online courses whatever you can do to stay creative and build a strategy that will even help you the next time that something may uh, set back the amount of workflow coming in. So freelancers, I wish you all the best. Uh, employers, I wish you all the best as well. And thanks for having me for this talk on uh, HR implications for the coronavirus. Yeah, I definitely appreciate that, um, that Joey, just, you know, because I, I think it's a time where there's not necessarily maybe a, a structured playbook for what happens or what exactly you should do. So that's why I provide you, I, I appreciate you so much for providing that information on things that we can be in consideration and the things that kind of stuck out to me more than anything is erring on the side of caution with all these decisions and kind of um, remembering, I, I'm, I'm going to call it the golden rule where you kind of treat people the way you want to be treated. So as an employer, just making sure that you understand understand that um, you, you're not, I guess, 
leading with a fist and but you're you're understanding like the times that we're in and exactly what you can do to kind of make it a great environment and, and a safe environment and a healthy environment as well yeah these are unprecedented times yeah. and it's going to call for unprecedented unprecedented measures and the more you can gather advisors around you whether that's from uh trusted experts online or people in your community you will get to the best decision uh, with a lot of bright minds pouring into that, that decision-making process. So don't make these decisions in silos. Definitely reach out to some experts. Yeah, absolutely. Well, I appreciate you so much again, uh, Joey. And, and again, for people that may not have heard this, you know, heard the actual um, the interview that we did, what's the best way for people to get in touch with you if they, they have any questions or anything? Yes. Book a call with us at jumpstart-hr.com slash contact. That's going to be the fastest way to speak to someone on the team. Uh, you can also send me a DM or tweet at Joey V Price HR. That's on Instagram and Twitter. And then we have a course that uh, hopefully we can share out uh, a link, but it's on our courses.jumpstart-hr.com. And it's the very first one. It's all about coronavirus and navigating that for HR and people leaders. Awesome. 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 Well, thank you so much again, Joey. We will have that information in the show notes so that everybody can click through and follow up with you and connect with you, but appreciate you again, my friend. And I hope you have a phenomenal rest of the day. Hey, thanks. Thanks for that. And thanks for all you're doing to help people stay safe and aware.